you've got to go and look at this piece by Amy Otto of The Federalist because pluripotent cells can be grown in a lab. We, as, an, as a society, as humans, we do not have to do this procedure in order to do the scientific research that we could all agree right. that we need. So you can still support the research without supporting this, and you should. Yeah, I mean, the, the defense of barbarism is predicated at starting with the end result. We already have this tissue. It's a shame to let it go to waste, as if the fact that right. it's not garbage because it's a heart. It's only garbage if it's a baby. Right. So if you, look, if you throw the baby away, that's garbage. But no, the heart's precious. You could get something. You could save a life. Well, you just threw away a baby, but the heart's valuable. That's the, that's the horror and the terror and the hypocrisy that nobody can understand. And what a reversal that we've seen in society. We based communities on the idea of protect, pr protecting children based on the sacrifice of adults. Adults worked and died so that their next generation would, would grow and prosper. We have now reversed it. And evolved. Yep. We have reversed it so that adults use children in order to survive because now we have this tissue that can allow us to live longer and once you've accepted this idea that you can use tissue to make yourself healthier what's to stop you from making it into a nutritional supplement what's to stop you from from any kind of weird bizarre amoral act because you've already made the leap if you're okay with this then you are okay with everything and nothing will stop us because we don't give a damn. So let's just be clear because we went from Eric saying that he doesn't... Oh, I'm clear. No, I'm no, very no. clear on but this. But we went from Eric... I know. I disagree with you. I'm telling you, I disagree with okay. you on both parts. Okay. I, I don't believe that because you have these unborn children, you can use them for stem cell research because, well, they're already there. That's BS. The fact is, it's a sh it, it, your, your argument is, it's a shame they don't go to waste. Well, then you're actually confessing that they're not a waste. That's actually not my argument. But my argument is that stem cell research and embryonic stem cell research, research people like Nancy Reagan support it, mm -hmm. who is not pro-life, pro-choice as far as I can tell, have absolutely, it is a scientific advance. And if you want to say that you on, want to ban, if you want to say that you want to ban. On the bodies. No, but. On the okay, bodies. I guess that's where you and I disagree. I disagree with you that it's a So body. it's just a lump, of, a lump of cells that we can harvest because it's going to make us live 10 years well, younger. I don't want to live 10 years longer. So it's if I a knew. body. It's just a dead so body. So you can look butchered. at the body. Let That's why. Oh, by the way, and you can use an ultrasound to see how healthy those organs are, but God forbid you use an ultrasound to show how healthy the baby so is. So let's be clear. This is not about defunding Planned Parenthood because Planned Parenthood has a uh, profit motive. It's about defunding Planned Parenthood because you want to ban abortion. No. no see, that's where you're wrong. No, I have exactly accepted. I've, no, I've accepted the right. inevitability of abortion, but I refuse to accept the amoral consequences that are even far worse than that, which is harvesting them, mm -hmm. because we've decided that as an adult society, we can use children to make our lives better. And if a woman, decides, be the she, if a woman decides that that's what she wants to do with her aborted fetus, you, you're going to tell absolutely, her that you know better? Absolutely not. Okay. There's nothing about a pro-choice decision that you could dismember that unborn child. If you've already made up your mind that it, sure. it's on you when you have the right. abortion, it's on you. But then you can't then expand the idea of pro-choice to, by the way, I'm having the abortion and feel free to slice it up. Okay, other than throw it in the garbage because that's what's going to happen to it, right? There's your, you just, no. you just proved my no, point. I didn't. It's garbage unless we use it. Well, and she said oh. it's not a body, even yeah. though you can see a you baby's body. You see that this is a circular argument that I just won. I, mean, uh, I so see it's a circular <laughs> argument that you just lost, but we can discuss that. I don't think yeah. anybody would agree with that, actually. It was pretty convincing. Yeah. Destro destroyed your argument. Oh, okay. Stay tuned for a jam-packed fast.